Hey guys, it's Queen Jax and welcome back to my channel. Now this vlog is a bit different from the ones I've done before, but this is my dream jobs and my dream cars, so I hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, then hit that like button if you want to. Anyways, um, I'm going to go with my dream cars first and then I'll do my dream jobs. Um, so the first one would be Lamborghini Aventador. The second one would be Audi A3 or A4. The second one would be BMW i8 or something. I'm not a big fan of BMW, but that would one that one would be my, my dream car. Um, the third one would be a mini hatch convertible because I love convertible cars. Although when you're going to Woburn, it's not a good plan to go and have a convertible mini car in the in Woburn because monkeys can actually tear up the convertible part of the car which is not good um the fourth one would be a Range Rover Discovery Sport now for that car I would have a red or a blue car for that one uh the fifth car would be or well, sixth car would be, gosh, Tesla Model X. Sixth one would be, the sixth or seventh one would be um, Mazda. I'm really, I'm really a big fan of Mazda cars. Um, and the last one, which would be eight, would be, gosh, um, a Porsche Cayenne Sport. Um, and then now my future plans. Now my future plans uh, includes finding a boyfriend, which, which I have already. Um, moving out and finding a flat by myself. And then I'll ask one. I'll I'll ask uh, my boyfriend to move in. Um, and then after that, I think going on going on on a few dates before getting married or having kids. But I'd really want two kids, um, four at most, but two would be fine. Um, a boy and a girl, obviously. Um, although I could get a girl and a girl, or a boy and a boy, but I prefer to have a boy and a girl, so it's fair. Um, and then move out, get a decent house with a, with a massive garden and a moderate-sized kitchen with at least three to four bedrooms so then people can like have a sleepover and stay at ours for a while and um i would definitely want to get a pet in the, in the future like a lizard so like a reptile or a dog that's not jumpy and not so um bark barky because i don't like really barky dogs like really loud ones because I've got sensory issues and my ears are really sensitive when it comes to like really loud noises so I prefer a dog that's temperament um not so barky and not so loud um and doesn't go to strangers quite often so I, I would train the dog to do that I would train the dog not to go up to people when they don't have permission to do that um, but I'll, I'll train it to do that, so some people from Little Grove, I'm not going to say any names, but if they come to the house and there is a dog, just bear in mind that I have trained it not to jump at you or, or, or whatever. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm just letting you guys know, um, but I'm not going to say any names because I think they know already if I don't say the name. But yeah, one of my friends at Little Grove. I'm a fan of dogs. Neither am I, but I might get over the fear of of having xenophobia or xenophobia. I I've forgotten what it is, but it's a fear of dogs. Um, it's in it's an irrational one to be honest, because I love dogs, um, especially pogs, because they're my favorite. They're so cute. But um, but yeah, that's my um. So if I had a pet dog or so like a labrador or a pug or whatever i would name it if if it was a boy or a girl i, I would name it 
if it was a boy, Chase as a Labrador, for I mean for a Labrador, and then for a girl Labrador it would be Daisy. If it was for if if it was for a pug, then it would be for a boy for the pug would be I don't know, I haven't thought of pug names. Um Definitely not Paul. <laughs> Paul the pug. <laughs> um Probably Benji. Benji Pe I would name the male pug probably Benji, sort of for Benjamin, and for a girl pug, I think I might call it Peggy, no not Peggy, <laughs> um, I think I'd call it, or oh, her, um, princess, either princess or um, Penelope, <laughs> which is kind of obvious if you're thinking about it but but yeah that's um so that's if i had a labrador or a pug um i would not, i would like to get like a, a decent sized house with three to four bedrooms and then people can come over have sleepovers and have stay a while and stay with us for a bit um and I will get a dog that doesn't like come up to you quite often. I'll I'll train the dog in the future in the in my in my f future. I would I would train it not to come to you guys because there are some jumpy dogs out there which I hate. Um, that's the why that's why I've got an irrational fear of dogs. But um, yeah. Anyways, um, I think I might stop here to be honest. Um, if you did like this video, then please give a like down below the video. Click the notification bell so you never miss a video. Please subscribe to the channel, it would mean a lot to me. And leave a comment down below for what goes with to do next. See ya!